So guys, the craze of runes is actually picking up and I have seen a lot of these runes being minted in the past 24 hours ever since, you know, the halving has occurred. And I truly believe that, you know, you really have an opportunity here, but you have to be very mindful about what rune you are trying to mint and where you are investing your hard earned money into. So in this video, I will be showing you how I do my research while trying to find a good rune to mint and also how you can do that same thing as well because a lot of people are creating these videos on runes at the moment, but nobody is actually telling you that. So this right here is going to be alpha for you all. And I truly believe that if you follow each and every step as I tell you to, then you might just land on a 10x 100x or even a 1000x opportunity for the short mid and also long term considering i truly believe that runes are going to stay here for a while and um, just like inscriptions and ordinals this is definitely going to be the next meta in the bitcoin ecosystem so make sure that you do not miss any part of this video and watch it till the very end So guys, welcome back to Hybrid Whales and first off, let's start with the mint from last day, which was Satoshi Nakamoto. So I minted this one and in my previous video, I actually explained everything about runes and if you have not yet watched that video, then I really don't think that you would be understanding anything that I am going to share in this video. So make sure that you watch that video from yesterday first and then come back to this video because this is going to be part two of that. So I basically did mint the Satoshi Nakamoto rune uh, on the first day this was the sixth one to come out so this naturally has a very huge backing in my opinion because you know this is the sixth one ever minted and we still don't know who is behind this one so who basically deployed this on the blockchain and that is also in itself very intriguing in my opinion and i am definitely going to hold this one for the longer run i really think that uh, you know selling this at the moment is not going to be a good option for me but yes if you did mint this one then you can see on unisat marketplace it is currently live it is currently listed and the cost for minting 100 of these was around 180 and 190 dollars and currently the floor price for 100 of these is running at around $570 so it's almost a 3x from that price and uh, I guess uh, last night it was at $750 so it has come down a bit since then but I really think that this still is not going to be the fair value for this one and once you know the person who basically created this one comes out it might just create a uh, a little more hype around this project you know if this has some sort of a utility then definitely the hype will increase and also guys in case there is no one to show up for this mint or you know the one who was etching this on the bitcoin blockchain in case we never know that then it would be much better in my opinion because this is satoshi nakamoto so yeah so I, i'm just putting it out there so in case you want to take profits you can basically just sell if you minted this one and also you can see that there are a few more right here which you can definitely check out i will drop a link to this page this is the marketplace in the description section below and interestingly the reason why i am going to hold this one is because of the fact that gate.io has basically listed this one just one day after it was minted so you can see right here satoshi nakamoto is now listed on gate.io with the ticker satoshi and also they have also listed this one which is meme rune so meme economics uh, rune has also been listed on gate.io which is a very good thing in my opinion because you know these exchanges have to pick up on these runes so that you know the trading volume increases and that would actually help building the hype around them so now what we can do is basically you can definitely mint your rune on this website which is luminex.io and i give you detailed instructions on how to do that as well and if i find a good mint uh, while doing my research that i'm going to show you so i will be doing a mint in front of you if i find one good enough all right so the first thing that you can see right here is basically these are all the runes that are currently available to mint and you can see right here there will be a mint option right here in front of the ones that you can still mint this one satoshi nakamoto 
has already been minted out and uh, also guys we have to take into consideration a few more things that you have to be very mindful of while choosing the one that you want to mint so i am going to use this website which is audiscan.com so i will also be linking this page in the description section below so make sure that you check that out so once you visit this page you will see something like this you just connect your wallet which has to be xverse or unisat whichever you are working with and right here if you just sort it with oldest so it's going to give you uh you know in in the right chronology so you have zero one two three four this is the exact order in which these were minted and uh you know the interesting thing is this one which is fehu we already know the team behind this one is basically the first one after uncommon goods so this naturally has some sort of a value so if you just click on this you can see right here so if you just copy this one and put it on uh, luminex let's just see if we can get this one so right here you can see we can just check the same thing on this website as well so the max supply is uh, 111 0.1 million and uh, pre-mine is 110 million all right so we have uh, a few that are still left which we can mine so you can see right here a lot of people are mining some are mining 700 of these which will cost a lot so let's just go back and click on the mint button right in front of this one and right here you can see you can basically choose the pre-split option in case you have used the utxo splitter but in case you have not yet used that so you can basically just click on auto split and then you can click on mint one so you can see right here almost minted out high risk of being front run so what does that mean it means that even if you mint this one uh, your gas might just be spent but you might not uh, basically get the mint so this is the risk that you have because you know 99.02 percent have been minted already and 3240 mints are currently pending in the next uh you know in the next block so uh you can see i think that you know we still have a chance on this one even if we put up right now so as you can see 29,000 have been minted so 111,000 minus 29,000 is much more than 3000 so that means that we still have the chance so do you want me to mint this one but you know you can see right here guys the cost is going to be very high so for minting one you are going to pay 0.001 btc and if you just copy this right here and go on to coin market cap you have this calculator right down here so you can see it's going to cost you 69 dollars for minting one of this all right so if we just uh, you know do multiple mints so you can see the price has been increasing right here all right so this is something that you have to consider while choosing which one to mint so this has to be uh, you know this one mint has to be or one rune of this one has to be more than 69 dollars uh, for you to be profitable so do we have this one right now on unisat so you can see right here this is the one so we select this so right now one is going for around 22 dollars so this one is not going to be profitable for you so if you want to mint this one you can basically just buy it from here all right so this is something that you can do the research uh, before you mint any of these and let's just get back to this and now we can see that uh, you know uh, in front of the ones that are not mintable the ones that are you know 100 percent pre-mined you will see this uh, option which is not mintable so this one is not mintable dog to the moon also not mintable runix token which is from bvm so bvm i am expecting uh, you know it has to be a good project in my opinion because they have minted on number four which is a big thing in my opinion and if you see bvm on coin market cap it's just at 122 million dollars so this is working tremendously uh, you know expanding the bitcoin infrastructure i bought this one right around here uh in just below 2.5 dollars so we are above uh five dollars so i'm uh, already you know at a 2x on this one we also shared this in the 100x program so if you want to join that then make sure that you click the link in the description below and contact us either on twitter or on telegram now coming back to this right here so uh, the next one we can see so these are all not mintable so we just scroll down a bit so we have these coming up so we have shot the world hodl diamond dick and rune jesus on x.com so this one will end in three years so no point of minting this one right now when you know the gas fees is tremendously high at the moment we have this one hodl diamond dick which uh, 8610 mints are remaining 
I think this might just be a good one and short the world is also maybe it's a good one or maybe it's not so let's just check what we have so right here you can see uh, the supply is 78 million and 75 million already pre-mined so I'm really not interested into this one so let's just get back so you have to you know look for the projects that are at least less than 20% should be the max so if it is already more than 20% is already pre-minted then you should not go on for that the best case would be you know 5% or 10% 10 above 10% is, is also a red flag in my opinion but um, I can do with that so uh, because Satoshi Nakamoto also was 20% pre-mined so that is also something that you should be considering so let's just check this one which is hodl diamond dick looks like uh, some sort of a, a good meme project in my opinion and uh, right here you can see the supply is 914 million so 914 million and pre-mined is 75 million so i think i can go on with this one so right now you can see for one transaction you're going to get 10,000 of these so let's just go on and get this so if we choose high we are going to pay this amount of BTC so let's check how much is this let's go back to coin market cap paste it right around here this is going to cost around 59.58 dollars for minting 10,000 of these so let's just check again on Unisat marketplace if this is worth it so right here are the prices for this one so you can see right here guys uh, 10,000 are going to be bought for like $17 so again not worth it all right so you have to be very careful with what you are investing in and make sure guys that you're not paying a lot of amount right here for minting these uh, while you can basically just get them for cheaper on different marketplaces all right so let's go back and see if we have something else so let's just you know do another filter right here so let's go on for trending so right now we have hotel diamond dick which we have seen we have pepe with wit hunter we have pepe wit honkers uh, this one has ended so we cannot do this uncommon goods we are not going to do we have uh, this one minted this one minted and then we have all your tickers suck so yeah so this is already uh, a little bit funny in my opinion so let's see what we can do with this so we can see currently the supply is this and uh, i don't think that there are any kind of pre-mines all right so we can mint uh, all right so let's just check this one on luminex as well so let's just copy this and paste it right here so we open this right here pre-mine is zero which is a good thing per minute you are going to get 1000 max supply is 21 million circulating supply is 10 million and uh, total mints are also 10 million so rest of them are not yet minted so we can basically mint this one i guess but for that let's just also check this the price of this one on unisat again so we are going to paste it right here and click on search this one is going for 31 dollars for 1000 all right so let's go back to this page and right here we click on mint so for one mint we are going to pay 0 0.000007 so i think that this is also uh, you know a bit higher compared to what we are going to pay if we just you know use the marketplace so we are going to pay 46 dollars to mint this one and guys one more thing that i would like to tell you is that if you just click on buy right here there will be some gas fees involved with this as well so you can see right here total is going to be around 76 dollars if you buy it from the marketplace for 1000 all right but if you get it from here you are going to pay just 46 dollars or uh, yeah right here so 46 dollars so this is something that you have to understand and look for the projects that are good enough and uh, maybe do a little more research around that and if you want me to you know create another video on this and give you much more perspective on how to do the research around these runes and what to mint and what not to i will be definitely minting some and uh, you know i will be sharing all of those on the 100x channel as well to my alpha group and if you want access to that then make sure that you contact us either on twitter or on telegram but if you want a detailed guide on what could be the next steps on you know researching the next rune or the next 100x rune then make sure that you comment down below and let me know i will create that video as well apart from that if you enjoyed watching this video then make sure that you drop a like and also if you're new to the channel then make sure that you smash that subscribe button and also ring that bell icon so that you can be notified whenever i put up another update that's all guys i'll see you in the next one till then happy trading Bye bye